From the southernmost country in Central America, Panama, I'm Tony Vancella, SoundersFC.com. Hi again, everyone. The Sounders in town here in this country to play against San Francisco FC in a CONCACAF Champions League play-in match. It's an important game for us, you know, and being away in the first leg, you know, you want to make sure that, uh, uh, you know, you want to try and get a goal because away goals count double. Uh, so that's an important objective for us going into the game tomorrow night. We want to make sure that we can keep the game, uh, you know, where we want it, not give anything up. So if we can uh, keep it at zero, you know, that's a big plus for us. If we can snake a goal, uh, you know, down the other end, that's a plus. But on the same token, you know, we've got to take the first 20 minutes to get used to the field conditions, get used to the rhythm of their play because we don't know as much about them uh, as maybe even they know about us right now because they can probably get more video, et cetera. Oh, it's very exciting. I mean, it's, it's a great chance for us to accomplish what we wanted to in, in the beginning of the year, and one of, that, one of those things was to get a CONCACAF championship. So, I mean, it's, it's a great opportunity for, for all of us to be here, and it's a great pitch. The Sounders were allowed a one-hour workout at the host stadium, shaking off the effects of their long flight here. CONCACAF matches give these guys a chance to face competition they're not familiar with. I think that early on definitely be a, a, a chess game for sure. You would definitely want to weigh safety versus risk and kind of get a feel for teams and where you can exploit them and where they're vulnerable. Um, and so we'll go over the scout tonight definitely and again tomorrow just to highlight what we think that some themes that we could go after and, and also some themes to watch out because I'm sure they have a lot of weapons as well. And I think we expect they're going to be very technical and very fast. Um, one of the things from watching the, the, the Gold Cup, watching Panama, they were very athletic. So one of the things we, we emphasize is movement off, off the ball for them. So tracking our runners is one of the, one of the main things for this game. So I think if, if we focus on that and if we take care of that, we're, we're, we're going to have a good game. You know, Benega in midfield is somebody who played for them in the Gold Cup, is, a, uh, is an attacking midfielder, but is, is really a two-way guy. He gets box to box as well. You know, they've got their right back, likes to attack an awful lot. So, you know, there's certain things that we're aware of. And obviously they're at home, they're in front of their crowd, they're, you know, playing on familiar surroundings. So that's a benefit to them. Even though the Sounders are miles from home, a little pro Seattle support will not be a surprise. I mean, we were welcomed by the ECS last night, I think, at like 1 in the morning, 1.30 in the morning. So that was fantastic. So kudos to them. So we know we'll have some green in the, in the crowd for sure. And so training comes to an end at Estadio Nacional Romel Fernandez. This is where the match will be Tuesday night, 5 o'clock Seattle time on the Fox Soccer Channel as the Sounders try to advance out of this first round of CONCACAF play. It's actually a play-in round that will also involve a home game in a couple of weeks against San Francisco FC. I'm Tony Ventrella in Panama for SoundersFC.com.